Now from near and far, Lambeau Field's new scoreboards are a sight to see. Fox 11's Ben Krumholtz shows us some of the unique places they can be seen. Thanks to some new summer additions at Lambeau Field, you can now get a peek inside the stadium without even needing a ticket. But just how far can you go and still get a peek? We decided to find the best seats from outside of the house. Love it, but we can see everything from out here. We got the best spot, in my opinion, for tailgating. The new scoreboards are great because I can, where I'm standing now, I can look up there and see how full stands are, and I can tell when I have to go in. If you're driving in your car around Lambeau Field, you want to stay focused on driving, but if you happen to glance away, you might catch a play. Not everyone can be around Lambeau Field on game day, but with a little luck and the right angle, they might still be able to see it. If you work at the right place, you might also be able to get in on the action. I can see it from here on break, and I can see it from my office window too. I have a better, I actually I'm on the second floor, so I have a better vantage point from my office. I'm gonna bring binoculars to work so I can watch the game. You don't need to be on the west side of the Fox River to be able to see the scoreboards. In fact, you could be above the Fox River. As he swings the right leg into a brand kick five yards deep, here comes Cribs. Straight ahead. With the radio on and Lambeau in sight, it's a pretty good day to be the Mason Street Bridge Tender. But we're getting to the point where you might need a pair of these. It isn't the most ideal way to watch a game, but they do provide options. But who wants to watch a game on top of a parking ramp? A better place might be coming off the golf course. Yeah, you got a good view up here of the whole city of Green Bay. You can see Lambeau Field when it's lit up. Even during the day, you can see it. But you probably don't want to try to watch a game here. Um, you could. Maybe need some binoculars to see those scoreboards, but you're a little far away. These faraway views require a little bit of driving, but there's still other options where you can see the scoreboards. This is the eighth floor of the Coffrin Library. This is likely the last high point in the area where you can actually still see the scoreboards. But at this point, even the binoculars wouldn't be much help. While it is interesting to check out all the places you can view the new scoreboards, the best place to see them is still likely 1265 Lombardi Avenue. In Green Bay, Ben Krumholz, Fox 11 News.